Automotive Engine Lubrication System Automotive engines require lubrication to reduce friction and heat between moving parts, preventing excessive wear and tear. Lubrication is crucial for the efficiency and longevity of the engine by creating a barrier between moving parts. Indicator lights in automobiles signal low engine oil pressure, while electric and electronic gauges and a dipstick are used to measure oil pressure and level. Functions of Engine Lubricating System the primary purpose of engine lubrication is to minimize wear by securely closing the clearance between moving parts such as shafts, bearings, etc. Lubrication also prevents the moving parts from coming into direct contact with each other. Oil serves as a cleaning agent in an engine as it moves dirt particles to the oil pan. Smaller particles are filtered out by the oil filters while larger ones are retained in the oil pan. Another purpose of engine lubrication is that it serves as a cooling system. Lubricating oil cools the moving parts of the engine and transfers the hot oil into the cooler oil in the oil pan. The oil creates a seal between the cylinder walls and the piston rings. It also reduces the exhaust gas blow-by. The clearance between the rotating journals and bearings is filled with oil. The oil acts as a cushioning agent when the bearing suddenly experiences heavy loads. Oils reduce the wear on bearings. Major parts of engine lubricating system, oil pan or sump. The oil sump is a bowl-shaped reservoir that stores engine oil and allows it to circulate within the engine. It is located below the crankcase and is made of hard material with a stone guard underneath to withstand damage from bad roads. Oil pump. This part is located at the bottom of the crankcase near the oil sump and supplies oil to the engine's moving parts. It can stop working due to small particles in the oil, leading to potential engine damage. To prevent this, regular oil and filter changes are essential. Oil filter, as its name implies, helps to keep small particles separate from the oil so that clean oil can flow to the engine parts. The oil pump allows the oil to flow through the oil filter to the galleries before reaching the engine parts. Oil galleries. In the engine lubrication system, oil galleries circulate oil quickly to reach all moving parts in automobiles, determining the speed at which engine parts receive oil. These interconnected passages transfer oil to parts that require it, with big and small holes drilled inside the cylinder block, connecting to the cylinder head and overhead camshafts. If you have found this video to be interesting, just a friendly reminder to subscribe to our channel if you haven't already, and let's continue with the video. Lubricating system for two- and four-stroke engines. In four-stroke engine lubrication, oil is stored in a sump and circulates through splash lubrication or a pressurized pump system. The preferred choice is the pressurized system, but both methods can be used together. Splash lubrication occurs when the crankshaft splashes oil onto engine components, while pressurized lubrication uses a pump to distribute oil between moving parts. Two-stroke engines wear more quickly due to lack of lubrication, but high-quality oil can reduce engine wear. These engines use a total-loss lubrication system that combines oil and fuel to lubricate components. In oil injection two-stroke engines, oil is injected directly into the engine, while in premix engines, oil and fuel are mixed before pouring into the fuel tank. If this video was very informative, go hit the subscribe button right now and I'll see you in the next video.